Greetings, everyone. I am gonna walk you through how to build your website. So what I am recommending is going through Website Builder and that's via GoDaddy. So prior to building your website, you need a domain name. So my current domain is a lady named Pearl. It's the address, it's my address online. So depending on the name of your business, whatever it may be, you need to you need to purchase a domain name. So I was thinking for the purpose of this exercise, what domain do I even want? And let's see, I was trying We Are Pearls, just so that, let me see, could I build a sisterhood website? And wearepearls.org is available for $9.99 wearepearls.com is taken for 60 and for 69.99 it, it appears that I can purchase it through a broker but nope I don't want to do all of that so let me see if I can think of something else uh let's see and I should have had something prepared but let's see um let's see pearls atlanta Pearls Atlanta is available uh, for the first, it says for a penny for the first five years of registration. So, okay, let's do Pearls Atlanta for now, for the sake of this exercise. And you all, I already have a an account with GoDaddy, so you will have to sign up for an account with GoDaddy. So um, no thanks to all of this. I just want to purchase the domain name for the sake of the exercise. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and make the purchase. I want to do it through PayPal. <clears throat> All right, so Pearl, Pearls Atlanta is mine. So I'm going to go ahead and continue. Uh, it shows the payment that I made and that it's been emailed to info at a lady named Pearl because that is what is connected to this account. So what do you want to do next with Pearls Atlanta? Start a coming soon page, create a custom site, connect to an existing site, set up an email address. We want to create a custom site because that's what we're assigned for our homework. So what kind of website do I want? So they give you options and the reason they give you options is because they, uh, how can I say it? They help you create a template based on your based on, on your industry. So I am in education, but Pearls Atlanta is gonna feature all of you all. So I'm gonna click on photography because I want a website that's gonna showcase a lot of pictures because what I want this website, Pearls Atlanta, to do is to be a showcase of all of the pearls in Atlanta. So I'm gonna put photography, but let's say, let's go back. Let's say you're in cosmetics, makeup, uh, hair, excuse me, makeup, uh, lotion. Here's another one, hair salon. If you have a hair business, spa, life coaching, which I'm also in, um, but I, like I said, I'm gonna click photography because I want this website to actually be a showcase of all of the pearls in Atlanta. So it says, now what should you call your website? This should be the name of your project. You can always change it. So I'm gonna say the Pearls of Atlanta. Sit tight while we build a site. Okay, hook me up. Get me, get, I want my site to be fly. So let's see what they produce for, for us, for me. Okay, the Pearls of Atlanta. In this 60-second tour, we'll show you the most important areas. 
to start creating your new website. So let's take this tour. Okay, so this tab, the website tab shows a list of all of the pages on your website and it allows you to edit content and add new ones. As you can see this add button over here, you can click on that and it'll add a new page. Next, the theme tab lets you customize the look and feel of your website. Here you can choose between a variety of fonts, color schemes, and more. Okay, nice. I'm looking forward to that tab. Okay, next is, this is where you can add new sections to your page. You can choose different layouts and click directly this plus button. Here is where you publish your site. Once you're ready to go and present it to the world, this is where you publish. All right, so let's get going just so you know you can click next steps anytime for suggestions that'll help you build your site quickly awesome okay so i want to first and foremost change this photo because look we are not surfers we're pearls so what i'm going to do is let's 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 go through the website so they mentioned this is where you can add pages so this is the home page then you have a gallery and this is where I'm going to put all of your pictures and then a contact us. If anyone is interested in joining our organization, then we would have the information here. But let's say that's not enough. Let's say I want to add another page and then I can click on this plus button here under website and site navigation. And it says new page as an option, new link or new drop down. I want to add a new page. And then it gives me a template to choose from. Do I want a blank page, an about page, gallery, content, list? I want to do an about page because I want this page to discuss the founder. So, or yes, the founder and the actual organization itself. So I am going to put founder because the home page is actually going to talk about the organization okay so i have founder here but let's say i don't like the order of founder being last maybe i want it right after home or maybe even after gallery so that's how i add a page so now that page is added but let's go to home and let's start building around home. And as I mentioned, I want to change this picture. So I click on the picture itself and click on cover media and it says change image. So yes, I do want to go ahead and change the image. And I actually have photos already in uh, my actual library, but you'll build your library as you go. And these are photos of you all, but let me go ahead and change the image and add this as a cover photo right the pearls of atlanta and when i say welcome and let's say out high quality beautiful photography <clears throat> i can put meet the pearls of atlanta change it just like that and then see through a different lens i i kind of already like that but um let's see i'm gonna say we are leaders okay we are no maybe i'll just put model i don't like that either model the best you not that i don't like that i just don't think that's the best here meet the pearls of atlanta um a sisterhood a sisterhood of empowerment okay now here it says see prints because if you recall i had a photography layout i don't want i don't want see prints i'm gonna say uh what can we say let's see welcome meet the pros of atlanta a sisterhood of empowerment i can put learn more for now that's safe learn more right so here it says action button 
Do I want to link this learn more to another page? I sure do. I want to actually link it to a lady named Pearl page for now because that sends them to the school website. And then it says take payments. Do I want to add a quick take payment? Not for this particular one. So when they click on learn more, it's going to take them to our official website of a lady named Pearl. So I'm going to go ahead and click done. Now it says sharing stories right here. We can put testimonials of um, the different achievements of our pearls. So Sanjuri recently, recently has been signed to Ursula Weedman Models. Let's see. She is recently signed with Ursula Weedman Models. So we'll say congrats, Sanjuri. And then here, I can put a little blurb. I can either type here and edit, or I can type in here and edit. So I can put congrats to Sanjuri on signing with Ursula Weedman Models. I would like, yeah. And then let's see, Sanjuri graduated from a lady and see I'm gonna go ahead and go over here because I feel like I can see this better I can see better from here a lady named Pearl Leadership Academy in spring of 2016 all right so opposed to saying getting prints here again, I want to lead them to Sanjuri's page, her modeling page. So I can say, um, check out her portfolio. Um, check out Sanjuri's portfolio. And then have that, again, lead to her portfolio. So I can put a website URL, a lady named Pearl Models, because at one point we had, had an agency, but now we're focused on actually signing, helping our models get signed, signed to agencies. In addition to that, we're creating a portal where if you are in the process of getting signed, when when various people call the school and they're looking for uh, models or when we find castings within this portal, you'll be able to, to get that information. So that's something that we're working on, a sisterhood portal. All right, moving forward. So again, this is how you edit your information. And, you know, here is some more things that I can edit. So let's go down to this bottom portion here. This is your social media tab. I can enter in the Facebook tab or the Facebook information for the school. So I, yeah. Our Twitter, our Instagram. Our YouTube. And by the way, our song, our theme song, Slang, released uh, yesterday or a couple, two days ago. So you all check that out on YouTube forward slash a lady named Pearl. So as you can see, as I was entering the different URLs for my social media, these began to light up. So we're gonna go ahead and move forward and press done on that. So here's a portion here that says set up appointments, online appointments to get bookings. 24 seven, depending on your business, you know, this may be applicable for you, but it depends on your business. I'm going to go ahead and skip and move forward. But again, I press done and this is the home page. So I'm going to move over to gallery home page. Okay. Now we're going to move over to gallery. Again, I want to highlight all of my pearls. So pearls, these are the pearls that have graduated from our program. 
and have been inducted into our sisterhood. Once you graduate from our leadership program, you receive the privilege of being in a sisterhood of beautiful women. And we've now included men in our program. So it's now pearls and gents. So I have uh, just tons of photos of all of the pearls that have graduated from our academy. So I'm just going to click on uh, a lot of uh, a lot of these, several of these multiple photos. And for those of you that are watching, look forward to highlighting you pretty soon as well. So let's say this is what I want the gallery to have in terms of featuring our pearls. So I'm going to click on add to gallery and I selected 37 pictures. And these are pearls that are in Atlanta, Atlanta, but I, Tashish is not in Atlanta. So these are some photos that were in the template, but I want to remove them. So I'm going to click on it and press remove from gallery. Click on it, remove from gallery. Click on the photo, remove from gallery. Click on photo, remove from gallery. Click on photo and such. So let's say I want to reorder these pictures. I can just move them around however I'd like. Change the image. I can change the image. But here we are here. And then now I have a gallery of pearls in the sisterhood of Atlanta. These are pearls that graduated from the sisterhood. All right, so I am going to go ahead and click on founder, as I mentioned. Okay, the gallery is still in place. Click on founder, and then we want to find a picture of myself for founder. Let's see. Yeah, let's pick something fun. Let's see if we can change it where it can fit. All right, yep, this is fun. Okay, so founder, cause look, okay. It's a lady named Pearl. And then I can place my bio in this section right here. Okay. And let's see. And then moving forward with our contact us page, you can change information here. Da, 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 da. You can connect your reviews to your Facebook page once you connect it, once you create a Facebook page for your business. So this is how you utilize GoDaddy and Website Builder. I hope this was helpful. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and publish. Oh, I apologize. Let's go ahead and go into themes because as we saw uh, earlier, themes actually identify the colors that we could play with. So let me see. Oh, nice. Okay, that gave it gave the website more character. So let me try this color. I actually like the. I like either this one or that one. Let's. Okay, then you got this. Ah, okay. I'm thinking I'm liking the warmer tones. So in terms of my theme colors, or you can play around with your theme colors now. Okay, okay, where was I? Where was I? All right, yeah, I'm in the process of publishing this. Oh, no, my apologies. We were working on themes. So we had the color changes. Now we're on fonts. Okay, so right now it's on Playfair Display, which I actually like that font. Yeah, so there's... There's different things that we can do um, to add character and your personality to your to your website. Mm. Nope, too 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 soft, too soft. Okay, 
we're gonna settle with this for now I actually I liked what it was at the beginning and then you can actually click because it gives you options where they pair your uh, primary and your secondary together based on what they feel looks good together so um, let's go ahead and now go to settings or wait there was one other thing let's see buttons okay let's see our options for buttons we can have a square option a more circular option okay a more um, modern option okay so we're going to press done there and then settings is also an option and it says one your site hasn't been published yet for people to visit it yet but I do have my uh, URL, pearlsatlanta.com, site profile, the basic information, uh, Pearls of Atlanta, the business category is, um, I am going to say, let's see what they give you all these options. Should I say beauty, education, empowerment, nonprofit, it is a nonprofit t-shirt store note but we are selling merch so you have to go through this list and figure out what it, uh, what speaks to your business what's the closest what's most relatable art school yeah we we do do we do do we are artistes in, in my in my mind okay let's see i'm gonna put educational services for now Email info at a lady named Pearl dot com and you want to fill this stuff out. Address, phone number, 242526 Piedmont Road. Boom. That's it. Let's see if it'll take it. Okay. All right. And then I'm gonna press done. They want to know. Does go do go daddy wants to know your location? That's okay. Okay. All right, um, ah, I'm not feeling this. I'm not feeling this font. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to theme, font, and uh-uh, give me something else. Okay, and I saw something really quickly. Okay, basic information, social media links. Okay, we did that. These are just, I just wanna go through all of these different site history. So we're going to focus on more of the main, how can I say it, the main, the main things that's going to help you create your site. And then when you have time, you can go into these other things such as Google Analytics, the Facebook Pixel, and so forth, and find out more information on that. So we have our homepage, gallery, founder, contact us. Thank you for watching. Oh, let me go ahead and let me go ahead and publish the page. So choose where to publish it. I want to publish it at Pearls Atlanta or get a new domain free GoDaddy URL. I already have Pearls Atlanta. So we're going to go ahead and publish. We publish it, baby. We're, going to, we're putting it out to the world. We're putting it out to the world. We're publishing it. All right, your site is almost live. It may take a couple of minutes before your site is connected to pearlsatlanta.com. So keep checking back. Meanwhile, you can view it here. So let's view the site here and see what it looks like. Okay, I have my site. Why do I, I don't want a lady named Pearl Foundation Inc. No, I want pearls, the pearls of Atlanta right there. Okay, so... I'm gonna check this out. Boom, congratulations. Let me know if you have any questions. So we have a chat box automatically coming up. When you click on learn more, it should go to our Pearl site, which it does. I can link this to Sanjuri's uh, website. So, you know, those are things that we can do. Now we can go to the gallery page, check that out. The Pearls and the Sisterhood represented. Come on, Pearls. Yes, Pearls. 
Slay, slay pearls. All right, and then we can go to our founders page. Okay, pearl, slay pearl, and it'll discuss that. And then our contact us page, which features our address, and we can add a phone number, which is below right below here and you can add whatever else you like now i went to the site and there's things that i don't like like i said i don't like this up here so we can always go back and edit so i'm going back and editing because there are certain things that i don't like and that's what you're going to have to do uh oh no so now it's actually trying to sell me so i'm glad it says bill me after my trial no i don't want any of that so it is selling me, let's see, this basic one. So you all, you may have to pay $9.99 a month, um, but let me go back here because I don't like what's going on here. Okay, so it'll be Pearls of Atlanta is what I want. Okay. And then this gallery, I saw a duplicate photo. I think I did. Oh, maybe I didn't. No, I didn't. It's just similar. It's a head turn. That's different. Okay. Um. Yeah. All right. So I changed the, the pearls of Atlanta, and I'm going to go ahead and publish again and save and publish. All right, and then I'm going to go ahead and view my site. Pearls of Atlanta, yes, that's what I want. So what we're going to do is see if the site has finally connected to Pearls of Atlanta. So let's go ahead and click on here and see if the site is ready, and it is. Pearls of Atlanta is live to the world. So we discussed a couple of things. One, utilizing GoDaddy.com, getting your URL from GoDaddy. And then once you get that URL, it gives you an option to create a site. And that's what you would do. You would create a site. And depending on moving how, how you would like to move forward, there are various pricing options. The first one is $9.99 a month, and that's their basic plan. Yet, depending on what you want to add and the different features, it goes up from there. So thank you all for joining me for this tutorial. If you have any questions, you can always email us at info at a ladynamepearl.com.